So you all thought the last Get Ungrounded trivia episode was the end of the series, huh? Well. You thought wrong my homies, we're back. You all heard us, Get Ungrounded Trivia is back, but with A. Behavior. And with me to host this special episode is Boris, sadly this one is just a clone of him, the real Boris is stuck in his great grandfather's cabin, thousands of miles away from Go City but still give him a big hand. Yo, 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 you heard that right. Boris is back. back. Okay, now let me explain how this works. So basically, we will call each and every one of you randomly to collect your card. The card you will get will be based on your behavior as a contestant during the show. You will either receive something good, something bad, or nothing at all. But before that, can we have the cards on the board, please? Yes, sir. Okay, so since we are too lazy to explain what the card's values are, we will play this video explaining for us what they are. Pay attention. Okay now here come the bad cards. And now, here comes the worst. Geez that video must have taken a while, well now that it's done, this behavior card day will start, now. First up, Cookie Monster. Did I get a bad card? I think you meant the opposite because you got the blue card. Um, I must have forgot, what does the blue card mean? You get 10 bags of cookies and 2000 years of ungrounding, for finally not saying is it the cookie to every question given out in the show. Holy skibidi dub yes 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 I finally get to eat some cookies after so many years, this is the best day of my life, here, drink this voice changing potion. Oh my gosh you didn't have to do that. Yummy potion. Oh my god my old voice is back thank you so much Cookie Monster. You know what, you now get 100 bags of cookies. And you're ungrounded for 20,000 years, you may now go redeem your reward as the headmaster's office. Time to freaking party lol 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 lol. Wait. Can you give Elmo the dark green card since he's not here? Sure. Come on up, Brian. You get the orange card. But why? Because you cheated in the show by looking through the answer key in Boris's question sheet. But that wasn't me, that was my twin brother. Really? Then why do we have you looking through the answer key in one of our footages months ago, and admitting that you're the real Brian? Um, 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 
because my twin brother is trying to frame me. Stop lying, or else you will be forced to do 200 push-ups instead of 100. Now go to the headmaster's office to redeem your punishment. Okay, fine. By the way, you are also grounded for 100 years. Or third or next. You get the Gigabani card. The Gigabani card? But why? Surely this must be a misunderstanding. No mistakes here. You put laxatives in one of my Burger King meals a few episodes ago, and you even tried to kill Arthur all because you couldn't get his show rebooted. Oh, well about that, I'm really sorry. It's too late to apologize, you still get a Barney error, a very big grounding, and this sandwich I picked up from the trash. Oh my god why is there a f***ing hand in the f <laughs> You are grounded for 20 million years. How the f*** is a knuckle sandwich able to kick me out of the school? Hello, friend. Why no 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 stop 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 Do we have a Lincoln Wow here? You got this beautiful, shiny, platinum card. Um, this isn't the platinum card, this is the gold card. Ha 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 silly us. Here's your platinum card, for real. Oh my gosh, how did I get the platinum card? I'm so happy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we felt pretty bad for you not getting ungrounded when you told everyone to subscribe to Pappy Animate 2012. So we thought we'd make it up to you and give you this card for your intelligence, encouragement, etc. You've been by far an amazing contestant. You get $10,000 and a super big in grounding. You're ungrounded for 1 million years. Go to the headmaster's office to redeem your reward. Oh boy, I can't wait to finally gamble. What a good boy. I know, right? Anyways, up next is Mac a super. You get the light green guard for being a very good security guard. You always put in your effort to save the Get Ungrounded Trivia Studio, unlike many of the other security guards. You are ungrounded for 4,000 years and before long. you go, when I is must this ask you something. They How many end? family Probably in like half an hour, I don't know. I wife and three of course kids. you wouldn't know so since your IQ level is so household. low. I bet you're you will get five tickets He's not to wrong a tropical there. paradise. I mean, one time go you thought there were literal computer bugs on your PC and you tried to kill them but instead smashed your PC. They weren't actually literal. Yeah, and let's not forget how you always start with the letter B in the outfit and then start speaking to all the shout of nowhere. You little diff better shut up about that right now or else you are arrested, 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 arrested for 10,000 years. Alright, what the heck is going on here? What is all the yelling for? These two fatties were talking smack about my IQ level. Oh, I don't see how that's a problem. Now stop yelling or else I'm giving you the skull ball. Bob you're up next. No not the fat one, the skinny one. You get the red card. But how? Well remember that one time you and Alice were caught doing an inappropriate activity inside the basement? That was an accident. Uh-huh, yeah, sure it was. You're grounded for 1,000 years and you will get a special punch from John Cena. Come on out, John. And his name is John Cena! <laughs> Karen McCarran's in. Oh boy, I hope I get the diamond card. Because of your entitledness in the show? Absolutely not. You get the gray fire card. What? How dare you give me this rubbish card? I deserve better than this. Give me the diamond card right now or I'll sue you in court. Dude, 
You say this all the time, but fail in the end. Everyone knows why you got the grey fire card. You've been with no doubt the most entitled contestant in Get Ungrounded Trivia. You always demand an ungrounding whenever you get a question wrong. And sometimes you'd threaten to call the cops on the real Boris. Or even sue him. And I think everyone is tired of it. Which is why we are sending you to Neptune. Don't bother going to the headmaster's office. And also, you are grounded for one billion years. Have fun freezing there. Hey you big fat tomato, you're next. Hey, I have a name. Just come up here. You get the cherry blossom card because you're boring but funny at the same time. You're ungrounded for 10 up years. Time to the headmaster's office I guess. Bunzi you're up next. No 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 you are not giving me the green card! Not today! First of all, it's called the Maroon card. Secondly, you got that card for always raging over the smallest and stupidest things in the show. I mean come on man, why you got to do this? Thirdly, you will be grounded for 10,000 years and banished to the laziness dimension. Ah, what is this? Potatoes. 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 Mario the stupid plumber, come up here. You get the yellow insurance card for eating in the show when we told you many times that you weren't allowed to. But he had a small breakfast. Well you should have had a bigger one. Go to the headmaster's office to redeem your 10 years of grounding. No, please, he don't he want to be grounded, he'll do anything to get ungrounded. You know what? If you can make me a fresh cheesy pepperoni pizza, then I can bump your card up to pink. Wait really? Yes, now stop crying like you're trying to beg for forgiveness. Yes sir. Time to make some pizza. I still want potatoes. Here you go, some fresh, deluxe table, bucket pepperoni pizza. You got lucky, your card is now pink. Enjoy your 100 years of ungrounding, and I will share this pizza to the rest of the good card winners. This pizza smells so delicious. Couldn't agree with you more. Anyways Dora, you're next. Why am I getting the yellow card? Because you kept farting from all the burritos you ate from Taco Bell four months ago. What is my punishment? You will be grounded for ten years. That's it. You know where to go. What a burrito loving brat. Alice and Wallacea, or should I say, Juicy Alice, you're next. That didn't trigger you. Nah, everyone always calls me that. Duh, then I guess this will. But, but, how? This'll explain how. I, I, I can explain. Shut up, shut up, I don't wanna hear it. You, friggin', cheated on me with that, rich blondie, you gold digger. You don't know how heartbroken I am right now. I thought you loved me, but I guess I was mistaken for someone like you. Damn right you were. It's not just that, you even celebrated his mom's death at her grave. What a heartless bitch. Don't you know that death is not funny and meant to be taken seriously? Well she deserved it for meaning nothing to humanity. This was for you, mother. Pappy Anime 2012 You get the gold card since you are truly gold. Cool, but how am I gold? You're the creator of Get Friggin' Ungrounded Trivia, of course. You deserve to be ungrounded for 100,000 years. And this check for $1,000.
go redeem it at the headmaster's office, but before that, you also get a slice of pizza. Can I eat it here? Sure, but make it quick. <laughs> Yummy pizza. Okay you may go now. The thousand dollars doesn't really do much since I already have lots of money, as if I'm Pappy sure is will. truly gold. Would you like to share the whole class what you just said? Um. You're next. Um, um, maybe we could you know, talk this through. What's there to talk through? You have been a very, 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 very bad, 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 bad contestant in this show's history. You always try to manipulate people to never subscribe to Pappy Anime 2012. How the hell is not subscribing to Pappy Animate still even a sin in 2025? It just isn't, it always will be. And don't forget, one time you faked his death. Okay and just who on earth would have the audacity to pull a prank like this? But it was only meant to be a funny prank. A funny prank? A funny prank? A funny prank? Then I guess this one is too. <gasps> just like Bo Coil. You will stay in hell for the rest of your life. You are grounded forever. Are you telling me that I have to live here with the son of a- He's gone for good. Alyak, you're next. Oh hey McGorgai, it's the Alyak. In the Alyak, in the Alyak, in the Alyak, in Washington. Uh, uh. Still haven't changed of you? Well, you get the gray card due to your annoyance and get ungrounded trivia. Oh no this isn't the strawberry 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 she cake uh, uh, this is just a disgusting burn chip I got from Boris's but uh, uh. Okay that's it, I've had enough of your gibberish, you're now grounded 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 for not one, but ten, million years, and instead of getting challenged to a boxing match, you will be sent to outer space with no astronaut suit. Wait before that can Alyak have a pizza slice first. Cookie Monster is dad. You get the midnight blue card for being so oh, giving by sharing. Wait stop that's not for it. <laughs> you freaking idiot that was a card, not a cookie. Huh. <laughs> Guess I'll redeem your reward myself. Come in. Oh hey Boris, need something? Can I get two of those pizza boxes you have in the prize box for a contestant? Sure thing. One sec. Commercials and get ungrounded trivia episodes. You are ungrounded for 3000 years. And you in a pool of mashed potatoes, go to the headmaster's office. <coughs> well, that was something. Um, can I have my pizza slice now? I'm getting quite hungry. Sure, I guess. Yo, what's up? I'm back. What did I miss? Just gave Tommy the sign card, that's all. Oh, okay. All right, Mr. Cookie, as I was saying, you get two 20-inch pizzas along with your 3,000 years of ungrounding, for being so giving by sharing all your cookies to the host, the audience, and the contestants last Christmas, you may go home. You know, I think I should probably move this table over there so that the contestants can have more room to walk up to here. Gosh, that was heavy. Okay, next up our officer and Wayner and- Oh hi there, just thought I'd let you know that I hid a tomato in this video. Don't read the comments, find it- Hey, get out of here or you're grounded. Whoever finds it first will get a shout out okay bye. You really had to do that. He interrupted this behavior card day with his stupid message about the tomato. As I was saying, up next are office-
Mexican. Poop man. You're back? What are you doing here? Why can't you just call me Cole instead of Mexican poop man? You're not the real call, and also, I thought Boris banished you back into the forbidden ritual for good. Boris? But you are Boris, right? No man, I'm just a clone of him, but back to the subject, didn't the real Boris banish you back into the forbidden ritual for you know, doing your magical poop dance? No I never got sent back, that I completely forgot to do that years ago, but then I was still encouraging more people to poop, and that's what I am got to do right here and right now. Not without a fight. Try to pick a fight with me. Why wouldn't I? All right then bring it on. You're done doing your magical poop dance. The only time you stop making everyone poop and see if I wear it. That you said. Well. <laughs> Boris should have done this a long time ago. Whoa, what the f are you crazy? Why don't we find out? Sinara. Finally, after four years, no more constant pooping and get ungrounded trivia. As we were saying, up next are Officer Dwayner and Bob Shelton. That is not my last name! Whatever. Anyways you both get the greenish yellow card. This may be surprising to you Bob since you are muttering through lately. However, you still get a little warning from the Headmaster, but it won't be that bad I can assure you that. Same goes with you Dwayner, your behavior as a cop has been a little below average, as in weird, you sometimes threaten to arrest people for thousands of years over things you hate, now go get your warnings from the headmaster, both of you. You know, I feel like Bob should have gotten a card worse than that one. What makes you say that? I mean... Don't you think he could still be the same as he was before? What if he's just pretending to be more nicer just so he can be more mean? Give him a chance, I'm sure he can still mature through, nice and slow. Next up is Lu Kang. But didn't he get banished three years ago? Oh crap I forgot. Holy crap I'm finally back in Goanimit City after 3 years this is the best day of my life yay Not so fast, you won't be here for long, we brought you back just to give you the black card But 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 how? Why do you think? Don't answer that In most of the episodes of Gut produced in game show history, you kept trying to take over the show and host get killed trivia You've ended so many poor, innocent lives, and a few of those who have an evil soul at the same time. So what's my punishment? Normally you would be grounded for 10 million years. But I don't really see the point of grounding you anymore since you're just gonna keep committing more murder. So... You'll instead suffer the same fate as Mexican poop man. Wait what? What did you do to him? You'll find out once you meet him. Oh my god this is too disturbing to watch. Makes sense. What do you are next? Holy crap, I actually got the diamond card, yay 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 yay. Absolutely right, Witty. 
You get that card for saving Elano's get ungrounded trivia from Pokoyo after exploding like a bomb close to him. However, you kinda costed Elena a fresh new contestant zone after you destroyed it from that ballistic behavior of yours. But regardless, you are considered more than the best contestant of Get Ungrounded Trivia. You are also the hero of the show. You truly deserve to be ungrounded forever, and... A check for $100,000, you may go redeem it at the headmaster's office. Wish you the better health and care for your family. Time to eat me some pizza. How did he know I was also gonna award him a slice of pizza? How did he know about my family's status? Hello, I assume you're here to redeem your reward. Boo to Dave the freaking man child. What the uh, Stop booing at Dave the mature dad in the grown up one. Oh my freaking ground and days. Stop crying like a two year old. You're a flappin' beefcake. No wonder you're getting the Barney card. Three, two, one. What the Barney card? Not my Barney Barney one. That was the biggest childish tantrum I have ever seen in my entire life. Actually, no, the biggest babyish tantrum. Now you're definitely gonna get grounded for 10 million years, and a Barney error since you also have a love affair for Barney. Now get your muscular self to the headmaster's office. Right now. No. You are not my dad and I don't have to listen to you. Well what if I carry you there myself? Hey put me down, put me down, put me down, put me down, or I'll call one of my life. Why I want my mommy uh Stop using my left line. Duh, well that was something. <laughs> well would you look at that, it's Dave's brother's turn to receive his card. Brother. Since when did Dave have a brother? You idiot, he is talking about you. Who, me? Yes you, come here and get your card. I, I, I got the Barney.exe card. That's right, Alexis. You get that card because you act. Whoa, whoa, stop right there, buddy. My name is John, not Alexis, the king of childishness. Turn down for what? As I was saying, you got that card for also acting childish. In fact, even more childish than Dave. And let's not forget, one time you got pointed at Barney on national TV. That was to make Dave have suicidal thoughts. Well he won't be having them anymore after a Barney error, and you won't get one too, but in hardcore mode. Um, may I ask, what is a hardcore Barney error? It's basically a Barney error, except you will be given one chance, and only one chance. Waste it, and I assure you. You will be pretty much in the depths of hell. What? I don't want to die. Please spare my poor innocent soul. What? Oh my gosh chill out, you're not gonna get killed, stop acting so dramatic, get off the floor, and go redeem your punishment at the headmaster's office, right fishing now. Fine. Don't forget, you're also grounded for 50 million years. You know what I realized? What? Have you ever wondered why we never have control of ourselves? Yes. Well. Let's just say it all comes from the creator of this video. What? But how? There are so many ways how he selects the action. I think it's time. Eric Cartman. The gunmetal card. But why? For shouting the N-word in front of the audience, you will be sent to detention to receive your 500 whippings, and then you will go home to get grounded for 5 million years. Did somebody sh
Guess karma came to him sooner than I expected. Guess you could say that. All right, next up we have Clyde Sinclair. Come on up, Clyde. I said, come on up, Clyde. Clyde? Where is Clyde? And where is Arthur? They're nowhere near the city. What do you mean they're nowhere near the city? Come with me if you wanna know. We'll be back in a sec. Can someone feed me some potatoes? Here you go. Eddie Munson? Please don't tell me I'm gonna get a bad card. What bad card? Hut. Why would we give you a bad card, when we'd give you the silver card? But... But how, even after I assaulted you a few months ago? You might have beat me up. But that doesn't hide the fact that you nearly sacrificed your life by saving the world from the Upside Down. Upside what? You don't remember, you know, the Upside Down world, that alternate dimension, populated by humanoid creatures. I still don't know what it is. Wait, is it me or did he lose his memory? It seems like it. Do you think his memory issues are why he's still alive? Alive? Why wouldn't I be alive? Um, you heard nothing. I think you should just go claim your reward at the headmaster's office. I'm okay, I guess. Alright, what the heck is going on? After the original Get Ungrounded trivia explosion, your mom was killed, your dad and a few of your friends crashed into different states of the country, and now Eddie suddenly lost his memory. <laughs> destruction he will find out after this baby blows up Next up is the ice hoodie guy. Come on up wherever you are. Wait, we actually have three people on the white card. Okay. Looks like red hoodie guy dot exe and shadow Boris get the same card as ice hoodie guy. All three of you come up and claim your card. So what card are we all getting? You three get the white card. This isn't any surprising to you Shadow Boris since you're just the shadow, but it is to you Red Hoodie Guy .exe, since you two have been improving your behavior lately. And as for you I see, you get that card for a freezing animals with your snaps. But isn't that a bad thing? No, it's neither a good nor a bad thing, just a neutral thing. Um, okay. Nothing happens to you three, but you still get to have some pizza. Why don't you take a slice each and run along to the headmaster's office? Looks like we are now down to six cards. Our next contestant... Wait. What? I'll be back in a minute. Uh... Wait. Hut. Did I miss something? I forgot to tell you earlier, you also get this slice of pizza, sorry I didn't tell you sooner. That's okay. Now can we give the card to the next contestant? No not yet. What now? Ba Dust Arthur Pink on Clive Pripulid Bingha. Make the four cards. How the heck did you do that? Coming. Oh, it's just you. What brings you here? Do you happen to have Elmo in your house? 
Did I say something wrong? No, you're good. It's just... <sighs> Elmo is missing. You guys better not even think about it. Well, that's just too bad. <laughs> well, would you look at that? We got Frosty the Snow Woman. How about that be your new name? Ha 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 ha. This is what happens when you cheat on someone close to us. For Clyde? What's this supposed to do? If you got this as a prize from a behavior card day, then why doesn't Tomo get one too? Well, whenever you see him again, let him know I sent him this. I'll make sure to do that no problem. You take care. Wherever he is, I hope he's okay. I'm tired of eating cookies. Every day. Well, sorry, but this is all we have to eat. But we can get more food from hunting animals. You mean like in Minecraft? Uh, yeah, sort of. What are you looking at? Is this from you? Is what from me? This piece of paper, am I really ungrounded for 100 years? I didn't write that. Then who is it from? We're almost out of time. Should we just give the four remaining students their cards now? I guess, yeah. Do we have a junior Barker in the classroom? Uh-oh. What am I gonna do? I don't want to be punished for all eternity. Has anyone seen Junior Barker? Nope, never seen him. Nice try, Junior. Take off that box and come up to claim your card. How the heck did you find out it was me? You're the only puppy in this classroom, and you're wearing a yellow t-shirt with a bone on it and blue shorts, just like the Junior Barker. Now come, here. I don't know if I want to. You either come up to claim your card, or we will tie you up on a rocket and send you to Neptune. Just what I thought. So what card am I getting? Actually, you're not getting a card. What? I'm not- Nope. You're actually getting the devil's spear. Um, um, so does this mean I get sent to hell? Even worse. The black hole. And... You are grounded, 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 grounded forever and in the afterlife, for your obsession with joining Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, trying to take over Lena's Get Ungrounded Trivia twice, along with other versions of Get Ungrounded Trivia, whooping on some contestants in anger, and even attempting to demolish her Get Ungrounded Trivia studio building. See you in hell, At least I would join Pokorio. <laughs> Finally, he's gone. Can someone get rid of this cardboard box? Thank you. Next up is the old man from the original Get Ungrounded Trivia. Come up and claim your card. Gosh, I hate calling him that instead of his real name. That's too bad. Anyways, old man. You get the bronze card for making a really good substitute host of Get Ungrounded Trivia whenever Boris Rage quits. Why are you saying Boris as if he is a different person when you are him? Because I'm not his real counterpart. You're not. Nope, I'm just a clone of him. 
You are ungrounded for 10,000 years and you not only get to eat pizza, but you also get tickets to a tropical paradise. But there is a problem though. We're out of pizza. It's a good thing I saved this pizza slice for this moment. And you wouldn't want to forget these tickets. Go to the headmaster's office to redeem your ungrounding years. Sometimes I wish that old man could reveal his real name, because calling him the old man sucks. Let's not worry about that and wrap up the day sooner with more card giveaways. Sure. Looks like we are now down with just the bad cards. Two bad cards, and the next contestant to receive one of those cards is... Kalu. Oh my f***ing god why does everybody have to address by my least No no I didn't mean you, I meant the fake you, you know, Kalu. Stupid me, how could I forget? Kalu come up and claim your card. Don't you give me that expression. Fine. Much better. Anyways you get the fire card. But, but, why? You know why, you tried to take over the original Get Ungrounded Trivia along with other versions of Get Ungrounded Trivia and unfairly grounded contestants, just like Junior. So what's gonna happen to me? You will be sent to outer space with no astronaut suit just like Al Yak, and grounded for 100 million years. No, please, I can change. Please have some mercy. No can do, mercy is the worst teacher. Hope you're ready to say goodbye. Only if you can catch me first, ha ha ha. Get back here you boiled egg headed pheasant. Well look what we have here. Another human to sacrifice. Guess he's now a goner. I still can't believe she would wish something so harsh to your mother. Well it's a good thing I sent her to Antarctica. Now we don't have to deal with her juicy anymore. Okay you're back. How did it go with the Kalu situation? Let's just say, he paid his own life to end his own situation. But how? Don't worry about that. Right now we should get back into position and give out the last card. On it. Look at that skull bowl, filled with pints of that delicious purple blood. Technically Grimace's blood. But the Grimace is not made of any blood cells, just blueberries. Which is where his blood cells originate. You want up me there. The last card, or should I say the skull of Grimace blood, goes to... Tokoyo. But didn't the red hoodie guy assassinate him? Yeah, but we can just resurrect him. One last time. Is it just me, or am I actually alive again? Enough dancing you deranged blue mushroom. You won't be lasting more than a few minutes in the Go Anime world. How come? Drink from the Skull Bowl and you'll find out. That looks so gross. What is that drink even made of, and why are there Eli Balls in it? This is just Grimace juice, don't worry about the ingredients. And by the way those eyeballs are edible, now drink. Oh my god, why did I all of a sudden drink blood? Because you drank Grimace's, Grimace's blood. blood. You have been by far the worst contestant in the history of Get Ungrounded Trivia. Even worse, Nam Jr. and even Thumbs Up Guy. You not only tried to take over versions of Get Ungrounded Trivia, but you also demolished the original Get Ungrounded Trivia studio building, including Elena's, Sackets, Coles, and many more versions of Get Ungrounded Trivia. Although you didn't really demolish Elena's GUT studio building since you only attempted to do so thrice. But it still doesn't change your fate for your past actions. 
for you are grounded, 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 grounded forever and in the afterlife, just like Junior. Take this as your final goodbye. God damn it. I guess that's it. Get on grounded trivia behavior cards day is officially over. Sure is. Okay, well, I think it's safe to say that our first ever get ungrounded trivia behavior card day is officially over. All of our 32 major contestants won their cards and got their fate from its worth. As Boris would always say, have, have a, good a good night, night and, and stay ungrounded. ungrounded. <laughs> huh? Why do I smell rotten flesh all of a sudden? Oh my fucking god, I just stepped on a fucking zombie's corpse. TNT. I can't sense that you are a Boris clone. Who are you? Do you have something to do with this? I don't know. Why don't we find out right after I press this red button? No, not this time, not today. Come on, come on, come on just a little bit faster. We're saved. <laughs> he actually took the bait. Did you guys hear an explosion outside of the school? Yeah, it seems as if it was a Minecraft TMT. Where did that explosive even come from? It came from a secret lair downstairs. Wait, how do you know about this? Holy crap, is he actually shot dead? Run for your life. Hello again. Before I wrap up this video, there are a few things I need to clarify. In case you haven't seen this community post from last month, the reason for my lack of uploads last year is because, well, ever since I posted that video celebrating the first anniversary of Get Ungrounded Trivia about two years ago, I decided to take a little break from Go Animate and focus on other aspects of life like school and family. But little did I know the break was gonna last longer than the one I'd expect. Which sort of took away my motivation to animate for so long that I can't even remember the last time I uploaded an animation like this. I know I keep bringing up this message in almost every video this past year. But I thought I could bring some clarification in this message this time. And it's not just that, after I started high school a few months ago, I have been so bombarded with school work so bombarded to the point where I barely have any time to animate. But don't think I'll stop uploading for you guys, because that is never going to happen, at least not for a long time. I wouldn't have been a well-known Go Animator with over 4,000 subscribers and a bunch of Go Animator friends if it weren't your guys' support from the beginning. That's it for now, never forget to smash that subscribe button, hit that like button and turn on the notification bell for new notifications if you ever like to see more content like this. Hope you all have a fine evening and I'll see you in the next video.